Pokimane, Pokemon, Pokemon, goes by many names and she's pretty comfortable with you pronouncing it however you want so you can't grill me on this video. Pokey is the number one female streamer with 5 million followers on Twitch and probably one of the most famous girls on YouTube with over 5 million subscribers there. Other than that, Pokimane has 5 million followers on Instagram, 2.8 million followers on TikTok and look, that's definitely gone up by the time you watch this. However, these social platforms and the multiple accounts she owns are part of the reason Pokimane has a net worth of over 3 3 million dollars. Now you might be wondering right now how Pokimane went from zero to the number one female streamer and how much money she makes out of her million subscribers. That's what I'm going to show you in this video. I break down the stories and strategies of the people you watch online. Subscribe to keep learning. Did you know that before Pokimane pursued her streaming career, she actually studied chemical engineering at McMaster University, later on dropping herself out with the reason that she wanted to become a full-time streamer? Stop, I know, you might have heard this one before, but you can still pursue your streaming career after receiving your degree, so maybe continue studying, or, you know, just follow in Pokey's footsteps, drop it out, and put it all into streaming. Well, most of the fans say that she gets more famous because of her enthusiasm personality and continuous engagement with her fans. But is that all what she's got? Let's find out and dive into this video. Pokey got famous by playing Fortnite released in 2017 on Twitch when she gained over 450,000 followers which made her account a place in the 100 most followed accounts. Then later on named as the Twitch Streamer of the Year at the Shorty Awards in 2018. Fortnite made a lot of streamers and gamers famous. It's crazy how one game can have so much impact. By the way, who's your favorite Fortnite influencer that I should break down next? Now you might hit me say this and you're like, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pokey started way before this. Yes, true, she had quite a good presence with League of Legends. However, it wasn't until Fortnite that she really broke out into internet stardom. We all know Twitch, it's a platform where you do your live streaming of your gameplays, well not actually just gaming but also various live content, basically YouTube the only difference is everything's live with predominantly it being a gaming focus. Pokey however has been able to span across not just gaming but other genres as well and not just one game. Pokemane didn't limit herself in just playing a game or two, she's also known again for playing League of Legends and then Mobile Legends. This strategy makes her account grow more and more followers followers every day as she's able to span across multiple games. Then, in addition to her Twitch account, Pokimane also has two active YouTube channels called Pokimane, just her name, the one with 5 million subscribers, where she uploads vlogs about herself, cosplays and daily life. Then she has Pokey ASMR. This has almost 1 million subscribers where she does the ASMR videos in particular. These two channels are a key part of how Pokimane earns $50,000 a month. Then on TikTok, you can catch Pokimane with almost 3 million followers. This is where she showcases her cuteness and charm in those short form TikTok S style videos. Then with all of these millions of subscribers and followers, how much do you think she's actually getting paid for it? Well, Pokimane has an estimated net worth of up to $3 million. She has recently uncovered that streamers earned around $10,000 per 3,000 subscribers on Twitch. And so Pokey currently has 9,758 active subscribers as of now June 22 in 2020. All things considered, she's pulling in around $30,000 every month from subscribers alone. Other than that, they are also making her money through donations, ad revenue, and then bits on Twitch. Pokimane is also getting paid by Twitch itself to stay on the platform under an exclusive licensing agreement for her content. Then, in a recent YouTube video, Pokimane said this. I won't lie, these live streaming exclusivity deals are big money. They're life chasing money for us streamers. I got deals from many different platforms, but it really came down to just two. Ultimately, I decided to take less money to stay on Twitch. I did a lot of research on all of it. The infrastructure, servers, delay. I hate streaming with a delay. Chat interactions are really bad for me. I really hate long delays. YouTube, on the other hand, also pays its creators through views and ads. 
This of course is pretty common knowledge. And then with Pokey having 6 million subscribers for both her YouTube channels, it's enough for her to create more than 360 million views in total for all her videos. So that being said, it's estimated that Pokimane is to earn between five and $10,000 from YouTube on a monthly basis. Of course, this fluctuates and she would definitely have earned more than that from YouTube. However, once you break it down, a monthly revenue between five and $10,000 is a good estimate. TikTok is a hard one. There's no real way to know how much money a specific user can earn on TikTok. We've heard some people making $100,000 per post, some people only getting a couple of hundred dollars. So calculate the roughly estimated amount a user can earn through post is done through Influencer Marketing Hub. And upon checking that, Pokemon's estimated earnings per post is up to $3,000. Given her views and engagement, this is quite possible. Pokimane is also able to earn even more money through, of course, brand deals. That's how she would do it normally on TikTok. However, this is also done across her other platforms. These brand deals pay her in every post on social media and mentions in her content. And for example, she's worked with big brands like Epic Games, Hot Pocket, Azure Lane, Geico, and many more. Pokimane also revealed that she turned down a $3 million deal with an unknown client and said that she's doing well enough being a streamer. That activity alone suggests Pokimane is sufficiently winning to live with just streaming each and every day. That's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is Young Hustle. If you got this far, please leave me a like. And if you've learned something, leave me a comment. I'd love to know what I've been able to help you out with. Once again, please subscribe if this is the content you're loving and I'll see you on the next video.